in maths, in maths, disagreement and argument are really, really important. Really important. In fact, uh, one of the uh, one of the topics I wanted to do, but I don't think we'll have enough time, is the history of maths, and it's just the history of people arguing, right? But we don't really encounter that much in normal maths. It's kind of like there's a right answer. If you don't get that answer, you're wrong. End of story, right? So we don't experience the argument and the discussion very much because we learn the parts of maths that have already been settled, right? Except for today. Except for today. Right? So, today, you're going to be arguing about something. Here's what you're going to be arguing about. Here's the time. <laughs> mathematics. Is mathematics about discovery? Or is it about invention? Let me explain what I mean. You are going to be debating a statement. A statement is, mathematics is, I better get the writing right. Put it down on paper. Mathematics is discovered, not invented. So it's going to be an affirmative, there's going to be a negative. You're now wondering why are we in three groups. I'll explain why in a second. Okay. Now, you'll get this all on paper in a second. Okay. Now let me try and explain what it's about so that when you go off and create your arguments, you'll have a thought about, okay, what direction are we going in? Let's think about this. Okay. Let's think about rules. Or, or laws, okay? Rules or laws, because in maths we have these, right? Uh, in science, in, si in the study of science, uh, we have rules, we have laws, and quite emphatically, they are discovered, not invented, right? You know, for instance, you're like, B equals MC squared. I know this sort of overlaps with maths, but really this is about scientific observation, right? Now, before Einstein came along and said this, it was already true. Didn't need a human being to come along and state it or define it. It was a discovery, right? Or, or gravity, or inertia, or on and on and on and on. In science, that's the way it works, okay? But that's not, not all kinds of knowledge are like that. Some knowledge is invented, and that doesn't mean it's just made up. It's still very, very important. For instance, let's think about, say, the laws of a country or a government, right? So, so sociology, okay? That stuff's invented. It's, it's designed. It's crafted. And that's why it's powerful. Because some people who are really, really smart and who thought really, really hard, they invented something with power and elegance and it makes sense. Right? So you can have rules or laws in a country that they weren't, they weren't discovered. So like we came to Australia and like, oh, there were laws, right? No, no, it's not like that. It was invented. Right? That's where its power comes from. So my question is, which category is maths in? Is mathematics discovered or is it invented? 